Magic of Multiplication Unveiling the Lattice Method Hello, aspiring mathematicians and English learners. Today, we are going to tackle a fascinating technique of multiplication known as the Lattice Method. This method, rich in history, will make multiplying multi-digit numbers not just simple, but fun too. So, are you ready to dive in? Let's get started. The lattice method is an alternative to traditional multiplication that uses a grid, or lattice, to multiply numbers. It's a systematic and visually engaging approach. Don't worry if it sounds complicated at first, we'll break it down into manageable steps. To start, we need to set up our lattice. Let's take two numbers, for example, 24 and 13. First, we write each number on the top and side of our grid, with each digit in its own square. Our lattice then has two rows and two columns, as both our numbers have two digits. In the lattice, each square is split in half diagonally. These lines will guide us where to write the digits of our product. Visualize a tic-tac-toe grid, but each square is sliced from the top left corner to the bottom right corner. Next, we multiply each pair of digits, one from each number. We place the tens digit of the product in the top triangle and the units digit in the bottom triangle. For instance, if we multiply the first digits, 2 from 24 and 1 from 13, we get 2. So, we write 0 in the top triangle and 2 in the bottom one. We continue this for all the digit pairs. Now comes the fun part, adding along the diagonals. We start from the rightmost bottom corner and add the digits along the diagonal lines. Each diagonal line sum represents a digit in the answer. Remember to carry over any value more than 9 to the next diagonal. To get the final answer, we read the lattice from top left to bottom right. The digits we get in this order form our product. If you've done the addition correctly, the product of 24 and 13 should be 312. And voila, you've just mastered the lattice method. With a bit of practice, you'll find that this method can make multiplication a breeze. Keep practicing, and don't forget to have fun with it. Thank you for joining us today, and remember, with each lesson, you're becoming a stronger mathematician and English speaker. See you next time, 